Okay, so this is what we're going to do. I'm going to try to show you how to do this, um, at least the way that I do it. So you can see, it's really easy to upload photos. I don't use that um, dialog box that Blogger has. So first thing we'll do is um, we'll go over here to Blogger and... <clears throat> Let me make this a little bit smaller so maybe it zooms in a little bit better for you. You can see it. Is that better? So we'll go new post. All right. Brings up this window. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go to photo bucket. You're going to hit upload. You choose the album you're going to upload to. You all already know this. Um, drag the image pin like that. This one, we're just going to do an example. Then we hit view images. All right? Oh, it's already uploaded. Oh well. So then what you do is you just click on the um, HTML code or double click, triple click so it highlights it all. You're going to copy it. You're going to go back to Blogger. Now this is where it's it's really easy, but basically what you need is you go HTML. Make sure you hit that HTML tab. Then you're going to type in arrow center close arrow. So there's your command. You're going to paste that code that we copied from Photobucket. So there's the image. Then we're going to come over here and we're going to close that center tag. So it's arrow forward slash center other side arrow. So there you go. There's your image. It's uploaded. Bam. Good to go. But now we need to change the size. It's really easy. Right after the quotation over here where the JPEG space then width, W-I-D-T-H, equals, quote, 485, close quote. It's formatted for the blog. Done and done. So now what I normally do is I just come back to HTML mode, hit space, type in some text, just whatever, and then come back here and then you can edit it like you know type whatever you want underneath it blah 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 so that's the way that I load images super easy um, you can also you don't even need to uh, enter a height because the width it automatically adjusts the height proportionally which is really nice if you want to do two images next to one another you just take 45 and divide it by two right so uh, what is that it's like 237, something like that. So 237. So check this out. If you do, if you just copy that code right there without the center tags, so copy it and then just paste it right after the other one. They're lined up right next to each other, separate images. Same thing if you want to do three images or if you want to do another image at 485. On top of that one, you just paste the code, change the code to 485, boom, it's in there. So as long as you keep that code, you keep it in between the two center tags, open and close, and you just change the width of whatever you're working on, you can keep it all in one center tag, you're good to go. So now if we preview it, you'll see what it looks like on the blog. So that's how you upload photos. Hopefully that helps. Um, I know it's a little weird workaround, but it's really the jam, and it works really good. So hopefully that helps. Uh, where did I get back to? All right, there we go. Cool. Let me know if you have any questions.